on probation tub. I think we need, I think maybe you just need a longer, I think you just maybe need a longer, uh, you need a longer stay at horny jail, you know? Like maybe you were let out too early. Brush our teeth, brush our teeth. Chat, what song do you sing when you're, when you're brushing your teeth? For me, it's always, uh, what's the weirdest song you could possibly sing? Cyclone by, uh, Florida. Is that by Florida? She moves her body like a cyclone. She makes you want to do it all night long. I'm coming out of my cage and I've been doing just fine. <laughs> Uh, that's a good one too. I'm coming out of my cage. I like that one. Hey now, you're an all-star. Hiking elephant to my roommates. Say hi guys. Brush a 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 brush. Thank you for the five uh five bits, Mina. My roommates say hi. Hello, Mina's roommates. Hello, how's it going? My name is Ryan. Uh, make sure Mina does not get, uh, abducted on her hike today, please. Um, okay. Should also probably put some vinegar on that back part. Welcome to stream, by the way. What's going to happen today is 100%. I'm just going to douse this thing in vinegar all the time and hope that that does something for us. Kyle Chikako, were you fibs banamfkkin shikarat? Hey, 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 we're up disk bar shoe wide geku am small stub wab 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 this kk I'm gonna skip the rest of that one. Uh, I'm into it. Uh, thank you for the five bits, Walrus. Um, <laughs> I don't know that we got more than a third of the way through it. The song I brush my, I hum to brush my teeth is Chopin's Funeral March. How's that go, Todd? Can you hum it for me? Uh, Walrus did say, I'm going to try complete gibberish on Bar Brian. Now we know what it sounds like. I don't sing while I brush my teeth. I just stare in the eyes of my reflection and contemplate my meaningless existence. Oh, Aaron. I hear that. That's the sim language. Oh my God. They were speaking the sim language. No summoning eldritch beings in the chat. I really don't know that this back part is actually the problem, but it's not going to hurt it to be brushed with your teeth. You know, you gotta, you gotta brush your teeth. Even if there's one area you don't get a lot of sugar, you still gotta brush your teeth, you know? We tried gentle strokes. No longer gentle strokes. No more gentle strokes allowed. But the other Twitch chat streamers let their chat summon eldritch beings. Listen, if your friends jumped off a cliff, Just for fun, would you do it too? Dun 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 Is that one, Tub? Eight out of nine dentists do not recommend this. You should try it with the battery in. You should try it with the batteries in. It's a lot of fun that way too. It's a ton of fun with the batteries in. Um <laughs> Come on, man, there are too many openings for dirty jokes. No more gentle strokes. No more gentle strokes. Now we are pounding our toothbrush upon this circuit board. All right, that was very aggressive, what I just did right there. Uh, to the back of this. <laughs> I know, it sounds terrible. Um, That was very aggressive. We should clean that off. Um... We're vibing, we're vibing, we're vibing. No more genital strokes. Okay, well, <clears throat> Addy, can you do me a favor? Deep into that mother Addy, can you do me a favor? Can you hit exclamation watch time in the chat? Moment of truth, chat. Moment of truth. Addy, exclamation watch time. The comment said, no more genital strokes. Only 5.9 hours. Unfortunately, Addy, we have a brand new rule. I'm deleting your messages about genitals. Which is you have to be watching for 20 hours before you mention genitals, specifically balls. <laughs> wee woo, wee woo, it's the horny police. He won't say horny? What? 
14 more hours and you can mention the balls. Game Boy, show us on the printed motherboard diagram where Ryan touched you. <laughs> on that note, I'm going to I'm going to go full cam because I no longer want to touch this thing. Um, I no longer want to, want to touch this thing. <laughs> Hi, Maddie. How's it going? Arena can go balls out. You can you can mention balls. To be clear, you still can't break TOS, but you can mention balls. Uh, I can mention genitalia 200 plus times. I think it was maybe 50 hours for vaginas. I think it's 50 hours before you can mention a uh, um, um, female. Uh, can you guys believe that for the first year and a half that I was streaming on this website, I for I did not realize that you could you could set a mature filter on your channel. And I streamed for a, an, a year and a half before making people verify that they were 18. I got to at least hear wee woo wee woo wee woo wee woo. Wee woo wee woo wee woo. Thank you, Aaron. Uh, a year and a half I did this with no... And this is why the internet is bad for kids. Uh, this is why the internet is... Hi, Mars! Exclamation Mars! How are you? Exclamation turd! Hello! Alright, we've done that part. We're just going to keep going. We're just going to keep going. I forgot that I'm no longer showing you. I'm sure everyone who clicks yes was over 18. Hey, at least I can't be held legally liable for that problem, though. Just like I pressed no, I'm under 18 on Pornhub. Sure, sure, sure. Chat's bringing the energy today. I'm. Uh, this is one of those streams that uh, makes me slightly nervous with the energy we're bringing, but also I'm loving it. ba da ba 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 Okay, we have gotten rid of so much fucking blue on this shit. On this shit right here. I think we are closer. I don't know that it'll work. We're going to do a little bit more vinegar, and then we'll do some more IPA, and we'll we'll test it one more time. And by one more time, I mean we're going to test it 20 more times if it doesn't work. Just one more time if it does work. Uh, meanwhile, there was surprise. It's true. Meanwhile, there is surprise. IPA, don't put a beer on it. You're right. I should use a porter. I mean, I shouldn't use something with that many hop, that much hops. You know. Um, Mars is sadly tutoring. Oh no, was that sitting before or after surprise was modded? Here's the funny thing about that. Honestly, is that I think it was surprise who helped me find it. I don't remember if he mentioned it or if he found it. <laughs> I don't remember. I don't remember. All right, a little bit more brushy. Brush your teeth, chat. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Sweet Caroline. All right, sweet. It is time for the IPA. Get as much of this cleaned off as I can. Um, let's do the IPA. We're learning, chat. We're slowly learning. I don't know that this thing is going to work, but we are learning. We know that the power switch is not the problem. We know exactly what terminal is the problem. We're getting there. Slowly but surely. We're gaining more information and we're having fun along the way. Testies, by the way. Um, Can I say globes instead of balls? Spheres? The rule is is whatever I make it, and the rule is basically you cannot mention uh, balls or any synonym of it. Um, are you gonna campaign for the right to repair laws soon, Ryan? I don't want you getting sued by corporate types. <laughs> are you not allowed to repair? I know, I know, like right to repair is a big deal with like iPhones and stuff. Are you not allowed to repair Game Boys? Am I doing something illegal? Don't actually answer that. You diagnosed a problem. We diagnosed a problem, which is which is fun. I got to remember how to use a multimeter. Do you know how long it's been since I used a multimeter? 10 plus years? Maybe we'll get to use a soldering iron if this doesn't go well. It's been fun. Knowing Nintendo, it is illegal, probably. Have you ever been to Cirque du Soleil? It's coming to Chicago December 2nd. Should be fun. Walrus, hell yeah. Hell yeah. I've never been to Cirque du Soleil. Um, I did grow up near... How do I do this without doxing myself? I grew up near a town. Um, oops. Uh, I grew up near a town here in Indiana. 
that I'm blue to body 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 that has a lot of circus history um so I've been to the circus quite a few times been to a circus museum a couple times never Cirque du Soleil Nintendo's probably like if you don't Sorry, if you have a Game Boy in your hands, you have to pay a fee. <laughs> Alright, we're just drying it up right now after the IPA. Have you been to Cirque du Soleil, uh, Walrus? We're excited for it? Hell yeah. You can't legally take your apart your phone, your property. I believe with Apple, there are some like... It's also... I mean, so... To be clear, it's just not just Apple. I believe this is also the case with... And there are reasons for right to repair laws. I think right to repair laws are, in my understanding, one of the like most um, skewed laws based on like very large, which you would guess, right? Like based on very large um, and influential uh, companies lobbying for them to be certain ways. Um, but it also applies to like different things like your car, like, you know, different car, different vehicles, I understand. Uh, like right to repair affects that as well um okay chat let's test it let's test it and then if not we're gonna use the multimeter on it as well um if it doesn't work but maybe it'll work maybe it'll work but yeah my general understanding is that like right to repair shit is is kind of fucked um all right <clears throat> You rubbing the Game Boy with IPA? What kind of IPA, bro? I'm drinking a, uh, a, a solid American wheat IPA, bro. Uh, bro. Uh, lots of farm equipment for sure, for sure. We were actually talking about this on Micah's stream the other day. All right. Gamers, it's the moment. Lots of vinegar. The contact is hopefully... Uh, I already had it on. That sucks. Shit. Fuck. I already had it on. There's no light. <laughs> Damn it. Um Damn it. So, let's think through this then. Make sure the sound just in case the light itself is broken. A little into oof by the way, a little into still broken. I feel like Mars is rooting against me on this on this thing. I mean, Chad is generally rooting against me, but I feel like Mars is rooting against me on getting this thing fixed. Mars, are you rooting against me on getting this thing fixed? Um, you ever got a phone call for work? I love it. All right, so let's do multimeter stuff. Um, all right. Hypothetically, The wrong button hypothetically wait wait why didn't that work why isn't this zooming why is the camera not not zooming? Uh, I prefer a true neutral stance. Uh, I'm rooting for you. It's funnier to talk like I'm not. I love it. I love it. Um, I want to zoom any farther than like here. Weird. Oh, well. Okay, anyways, um, we're going to test power from this thing. Hey, Mars, light of my life, fire my loins, my sin, my soul. Mars. Mars. 
All right, I'll tell you if it beeps since you guys can't hear it. So if we check the actual contact itself from top to bottom, that's beeping. That's good. So now we need to check from top. Ooh, it's still not doing it. Interesting. Okay, let me double check this. Damn, how the fuck is that not working? Is it that corroded? There's still hope, chat. There's still hope. So my understanding of a motherboard, a circuit board is like this. Underneath this paint and everything that's on top, there is... Yes. Beautiful. Can you guys hear that? Awesome. Okay. Whew. All right. So there may be a whole other problem on this thing, but I think we are close to getting power. Here's the problem. How do I describe this uh, without zooming it? Um, everything that is at least, at least wrong with this first part of this Game Boy is broken between this metal piece with the spring and this dot right here that I have the thing on. That dot right there, which goes right here along this path. I just tested from here to here, and that has a connection, which is good because that means underneath the circuit board is not broken. Did you figure out what to mess up next? No, I'm still working on that actually. Uh, however, from this spot right here to the base of the battery contact right here literally those that third of a centimeter sorry i cannot hold this still and also do it that like quarter of a centimeter is not connected if i can connect that i think we may actually have a chance i'm so stoked right now this is good we're learning more <sighs> So that means a little bit of vinegar in that motherfucking spot. And also, if if it does not work, if that if I cannot get that clean with vinegar, that is likely a very easy soldering fix. A very easy soldering fix. I'm stoked. I'm fully stoked. Fully stoked. I sent Tub a very informational selfie last night. How is it informational? Uh, informational. Talk to me. Talk to me. What uh? What'd you learn, Tub? All right. Vinegar on the shit. We'll just set the vinegar there for a second. I put on a tub tishi. Oh my god. Is this Maple Story music? This is a song by Glitch X City. This is my favorite of the songs by Glitch X City. Uh, it is... Oh, that's the wrong button. Yeah, it's a it's a remix of... Um, of a Pokemon song. Yep. Uh, Spotify application is not responding. Okay. Sorry, chat. One second. Spotify, why are you brokey? End task. Spotify does not want to play. All right, cool. Just go to the web player. Um, Chad, if you guys haven't already, uh, you have like uh, five days, four days to four days to buy some more merch. Uh, if you haven't already, who made it? It's Glitch X City. Yeah, yeah, yep. Strawberry's got it. Thank you, Strawberry. Thank you. Spotify died. Yeah, it's dead. I can play it on my web browser, which I think you guys can still hear. 
Very, very softly. There we go. I learned that I cannot look at any selfie of Mars for too long because I will lose my breath completely. To help Tub C, I drew a, I circled the logo with a red circle and drew 15 arrows pointing to it. Oh my god, that makes me so happy. Video killed the radio star, by the way. That makes me so happy, Mars. And Tub. Fuck your corrosion, bro. Get out of here with your corrup corruption and your corrosion and your bullshit. Gotta brush our teethies, chat. I'm gonna go play some New World before mentoring. I love it. Good luck, Addy. Get the speaker out of the way. Good luck. Have fun. Thank you. Hi, Mike. How's it going? Is this the same Game Boy? Same Game Boy, but we're learning, Mike. We are learning. Frankenstein, Dr. Frankenstein voice. We are learning. We are learning. We're learning. Have I mentioned that we're learning? Uh, it's the same Game Boy. How are you today, Mike? Uh, do, do. Did you know Video Killed the Radio Star was the first music video shown on MCV back when they still played music? I did not know that, actually, Starmer. I did not know that. Uh, we're using white vinegar for the corrosion, Mike, and thanks to the multimeter and using the like uh, continuity function and a bunch of research I did on YouTube last night, uh, we have determined vaguely whereabouts the issue is. Pretty specifically whereabouts the issue is, I would say. Time for tutoring. See you shortly. Goodbye, Mars. Bye. Uh, good luck. Hope it goes well. Um, I didn't know MTV ever played music. Back in the day, I found good music on MTV. Uh, I can remember a couple songs that I specifically found on MTV. Um, Nine in the Afternoon by Panic at the Disco. One of my favorite Panic at the Disco songs. I first heard while listening to um, MTV's uh, thing they used to do that involved... Um, what was that called? Shit, what was that called? They used to have a show that was specifically for... Um, alternative stuff and i found a lot of good songs on that it was like an alternative charts and your eyes are the size of the moon it's something you can't because you do just the way that you do when your eyes are the size of the moon i love that song uh that song by the ting tings say my name that's not 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 my name that was an MTV song I found. TRL. Was that it? TRL? I miss old Panic at the Disco. I don't hate new Panic at the Disco. Um, but I also miss old Panic at the Disco. But also, there's a lot of it. There's a lot of old Panic at the Disco, you know? The other problem I haven't considered with corrosion is that it would potentially spread over time, too. So... We may have that problem eventually. Ouch, I just whacked the microphone with my head. What was TRL? I like that one song that Panic! at the Disco had in that Batman game. Mercenary? I've never heard that. I also have not heard their song before night for Nightmare Before Christmas. Um, Tub says, holy shit, guys, my leg bones hurt. Either I'm still growing or my diet has been deficient lately. Aw. Gotta drink that milk. That's a bad joke. Gotta drink that milk. I like Panic has that one song. What's that song? Um, Death of a Bachelor? I like Death of a Bachelor a lot. Um, I enjoy that song, Death of a Bachelor. Uh, have I said it enough times? Death of a Bachelor. <laughs> There's so much motherfucking corrosion. 
Is the music really quiet for you guys? Can you even hear it? I'll turn it up a little bit. I'll never forget the first time I watched the Sugar We're Going Down video by Fallout Boy and being like, WTF, but also, whom yes? Oh my god, with the antlers. I know exactly what you're talking about, Aaron. With the antlers? Ooh! I know very specifically. Aaron, vaguely how old are you? I know, I know exactly the reaction you just described. <laughs> yes. I was very like, that was different than I thought we were going to get. And also, I can see what it was going for. And I'm kind of into it. 28. Aaron knows. Aaron and I know. When's your birthday, Aaron? If you don't mind me asking. I'm also 28. Um, For another month. I like milk, but I don't trust it. You don't trust it? Are you worried that it's going to be bad? Like, it's going to be like... um. Uh, expired? I like milk, but I don't trust it. What a sentence. What a sentence. All right, I think we're going to go IPA on this, uh, as a purple alcohol on this bitch. Um. I tell you what, I'm not actually using Megan's, um, toothbrush, but she is going to need to buy more Q-tips soon. If I can get this Game Boy working, or if I can't, the total cost will include one Game Boy and one entire sleeve of Q-tips. <clears throat> February 17th. I oh, gotcha. You're, yeah, yeah, two months, two months younger, basically. Speaking of diets yesterday, I accidentally didn't eat for 12 hours. Strawberries on that new intermittent fasting thing, except not on purpose. Strawberry. Oh, no. We got to get you on a self-care eating routine. Oh, no. I didn't remember food until my stomach was a ball of pain last night. Oh, no. Dude, I was actually just listening to a podcast literally yesterday, Strawberry, on uh, the science of energy availability. Which is not to talk about, like, whether or not intermittent fasting is good. Because intermittent fasting includes a lot of, like, your nighttime. But when you're burning less energy. But when you're out in the day and and being mentally active and being a physical person regulating temperature and moving around. Um, it's not great. It's truly not great to be operating at an energy deficit. The stress on your body is not good. Oh, is tub lactose intolerant? You're not. Okay. I respect the fear of milk. It's suspicious. Hear me out. I, I, I have a, a potential solve for your fear of milk. I have, a, I have no willpower uh, for any fasting. Yeah, me either. Um, potential solve for your f fear of milk. Hear me out here. Just eat it. Sorry, drink it quickly enough that it, there's no chance it'll go bad. If you drink a gallon of milk every four days, uh, there's no real chance that it'll be bad. You just eat the milk, by the way. Just eat the milk. Okay. Let's look at this shit. How absolutely blinded are you guys going to be if I turn this light up a little bit? Um, I would say I'm blinded. I look very pale. But I can see better. All right. Let's test the... Uh, Continuity again. Do it, blind us. That's such a masochist. That's way too much milk? No, no, it is not. Son of a bitch. We're really close, but it's not going to do it. I'm going to need to solder. I'm so mad. We're going to need to solder, and it's going to be such a heartbreak for me. Because I don't own a soldering iron, and I don't. It's been 10 years since I soldered. Oh! Nope. Shit, I hit the wrong button.
Hold up, let me see this. Ryan, are you low on your vitamin D? <laughs> I, I am probably low on my vitamin D, but that's more about uh, not getting outside enough. I got breakfast at like 9.30 a.m. Strawberry says, I went to work, came home, played games for hours, then remembered dinner at 11. I have a good, I have this habit of putting off food on good days and then on bad days, I guess I just forget. Uh, I must away. Goodbye, Aaron. As long as you're drinking plenty of water. Yeah. And also even just a little snack. You got to train that metabolism. Even just a little snack. My fear of milk has more to do with I'm stupid and I forget what I had before and the mixes that I get produce a dinky dyspepsia. I hear that tub. I can't drink milk until after I've run for the day. I can't drink milk until after I have run. <sighs> Here's the other problem. This solder. Okay, so take a look at these two solders, right? One of them shiny, right? The other one looks like shit. You'll never guess which one is the terminal that's broken. It's the one that looks like shit. Milk is strictly used for cereal at our house. Oh man. I grew up, I grew up on a, my, my dad is a massive milk drinker though. He drinks so much milk. It's truly crazy. All right. Come on here, buddy. Come on here, buddy. I'm going to focus for two seconds chat. All right, more isopropyl alcohol. We'll try it. What's a solder? What's soldering? It's spelled like this, strawberry. Uh, I also did not know how to spell it until much after I'd heard it. It's just for melting. Yeah, so soldering iron, a solder iron, soldering iron, is a very hot rod. And it's used in a lot of electricity stuff. Um, a very hot metal rod. And you use metal that melts very easily to, usually to connect... Uh, the things that require electrical current between them. So, or require a connection between them. So, you use a very hot rod, you run very easily mel me easily meltable metal against it to then pull where you need to. So, soldering. Soldering is easier than you think. I've done it, Mike. It's just been 10 years and I don't own, own a soldering iron. I gotta track down a soldering iron. It's a hot rod. So, these two spots right here are solders, are, are, are soldering joints. Uh, this one is the shitty one. You can tell because it's super cloudy. It's usually like, is it... What metal do you use for soldering? Is it, uh, is it like... My brain wants to tell me tin, but I don't know if that's right. I don't know if it is. So, you can see, you can notice a really clean, shiny joint where the light is... Maybe. The light is reflecting off of this one. Also, all of these little dots right here. Um, yeah. Whereas this one right here, nope, right here, is, uh, I cannot do this very well, sorry. Oh my God, that one right there is very cloudy. And what's happening there is there's metal prongs and the circuit board, and it's tin and lead. Some can be silver, aluminum, okay. Um. It just ensures that electricity flows between them. So it's basically connections for lots of the intricate little pathways for electricity and stuff. Um, all right, let's just use a bunch of IPA and see what happens. I could get a soldering iron if I wanted to. I don't own one, but I know my mom's got one at her house that my grandpa used to have. That's the one I learned how to solder on. I could use that if I needed to. That's just a, that's a whole process. That's fine though. We could do it. What am I going to do? Give up? Fuck no, I'm not going to give up. You think I'm going to give up? I'm not giving up. Hell no. You can't get leaded solder in the States anymore. <laughs> I'm going to kill me in aluminum foil. Don't do it. Don't do it. I learned how to solder when I was probably 
It's been more than 10 years. It's been probably 15 years. I was probably like 12 or 13. Um, it's been a while. The only, the only lesson I remember about soldering, my stepdad actually taught me how to solder. Uh, and my grandpa was there too. My, my grandpa was an electrician at a, uh, a car factory. Um, and, uh, but my stepdad, it's like one of my good memories, actually. It's my stepdad and my, who's basically my father and my grandpa teaming up on the lesson. My grandpa at that point basically didn't have the like dexterity to do it, but he definitely had the knowledge and my stepdad pretty much had the knowledge. Um, they teamed up and taught me how to solder. All right. I didn't know the solder joint is bad. Sorry if you're repeating. No, no, no. Uh, I don't know that it's bad. Okay, so I don't know that it's bad, Mike. I know what I what I remember and I think is correct is I don't know this though. If somebody wants to Google it, I would appreciate it actually. I believe if soldering joints get cloudy over time. Like if they started clear and they get cloudy, that that can mean that the the metal there, the tin there or whatever, is is corrupted and therefore might not be making a connection. What I do know, it's a sus link by the way. What I do know is that I know for a fact that this battery connection, there is no continuity between this and a place one centimeter away that the power needs to go. I know that that battery link is the problem. Um, I did a ton of research last night. And I even know that it's very specifically the base of the battery contact and the board around it that are not, that do not have continuity using the, the multimeter. So there may be other problems with this whole ass board, but if I can just get continuity between those two parts, uh, I will at least have ruled out that this battery contact is just bad. So. Um, we're like, we've narrowed it down for sure. For some reason, I'm actually a little surprised that not every house has a soldering iron in it. Nice. This is a hilariously bad picture. This is a very bad picture. Not to be that person, but what is she soldering? <laughs> what is the, what are they doing? <laughs> I'm definitely not an expert, but, <laughs> but I don't know what she's doing here. Uh, definitely not an expert, but I don't know what she's doing there. Some good troubleshooting on your part. Thanks, Mike. All I did was watch some YouTube videos. Um, the more important grip. I didn't even look at the grip. <laughs> that is the hot part. You're right. This is the handle. This is the harp, the hot part. Oh my God. That's so funny. <laughs> is that why that image is, is like, that's the hot part. Oh my God. I thank you for pointing that out. Arena. I did not even piece that together. Spotify does not want to work on my computer right now. Oh, um, that's fine. That's great. Holy shit. That's funny. I'm amazed that it whooshed Ryan. It did whoosh me. I thought, so, I mean, what I was more amazed by is like a soldering iron is just heat and you have to have like either something to add or something to remove. Uh, you're just not going to add heat to a circuit board is what I thought. I thought you're not just going to maybe, but what do you like? So that's what I was focused on, but you're, you're very right that what was happening there was that she had the, her hand on the hot part. It's okay. I hope she made bank. I hope that lady, I hope that, I hope that woman who was definitely just a paid, um, a paid, like, very quick uh, job for that Shutterstock photo shoot or whatever. I hope she got paid very well to be made fun of so much uh, on the internet. You know? I hope she got paid great. I actually watched a YouTube video last night, Mike, of, uh, 
of somebody who had a very similar issue on a Game Boy Pocket, which is how we kind of came to this conclusion. Um, let's see if I can... There's so much corrosion. Um. Oh my god. Oh my god. The horny bonkers need horny bonked. I'm gonna have to put a. Com I'm gonna have to. Here's what I'm gonna have to do. I'm gonna have to. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to. Uh. Uh. Did I just time him out? Yeah, I timed him out. Oops. I just meant to delete the message. I'm gonna have to put horny bonk on my Elgato stream deck just so that I can be ready. Just so that I can be ready. I don't actually have to even type it. I can just... Maybe I should just add a delete tubs last message um, thing. I wanted to take a screenshot. I got you, Tub. Don't worry. I got you. You need a screenshot? You need a screenshot? I got you, Tub. There you go, Tub. All right. Yo, I think here's the real problem. Ah, oh, shit. Uh oh. Okay, so I think we've determined what the problem is. I'm gonna check it with the uh, multimeter real quick, but. I think the corrosion around the battery has been, the contact has been so bad that the copper on the board itself is actually gone. Which would be a problem. That'd be a big problem. That would mean I'd definitely have to solder. Um, Let's check it. Have you seen Electro Boom on YouTube? I've not seen Electro Boom on YouTube. Hi, Dante. How are we doing? Who's Electro Boom? Shit. Okay. Damn. I'm pretty sure that the copper is gone. I can't like clean off battery acid and get it out of the way of the copper. There's no co copper there. I'm kind of expecting something like that. What's Electro Boom? Does he mess with stuff and then it blows up? He, d he does have Boom in his name. At least act Electro Boom's an expert. It's true. I'm about to have to give up for the day and just go get a soldering iron. Can you imagine the stories this Game Boy Pocket could tell? Oh my god, I like imagining it. I don't know. Imagine this is a kid, not to make it all tragic. Imagine this is a kid. This is a this is a Japanese version of the Game Boy. So this uh very likely, it comes from Japan. Um very likely this Game Boy Uh, belong to some young Japanese kid. And it's working, right? No, it's goddamn not. Uh, my shirt is on backwards. I just realized it. Matt, that's how you know you're having a good day. You get to 1.21 p.m. And you realize, uh-oh, my shirt's on backwards. Gotta go for a bit. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, Mike.
All right, chat. I'm not going to spend the whole stream doing this. I promise. I'm going to get to Pokemon here in a second. I refuse to let this Game Boy take over my life, he says, after he stayed up till like midnight last night watching Game Boy stuff on YouTube to try and figure out what the fuck was going on with his Game Boy. I'm not going to let it take over my life. I might let it take over my life. The last story it would tell is of a giant tearing him to pieces and like rubbing him, not, not to make it weird, and like poking and prodding him with very sharp metallic sticks. <laughs> um, it's been like six hours. You've been up for six hours, Matt? Oh, no. I love sourdough toast. I've been eating it in the mornings. It's so stinking good. Did you say stinking because sourdough bread stinks? Uh, I don't know that I like sourdough toast. I don't know that I hate it, but. I also don't know that I love it. Yo, I think we have, I think we have corrosion so bad that, uh, I think we have corrosion so bad that none of the original copper exists on the actual circuit board near this battery. Which means an interesting fix from our part. Do you think you can rent a soldering iron? Soldering irons are like 10 bucks, right? 20 bucks, probably. Probably can't rent a soldering iron. That'd be dumb, right? Uh, what is this song? This is the Pallet Town remix uh, from uh, Glitch City, which is right here. That this says, I have one I don't use. You can rent it, probably. I can go get one from my mom for my grand for my grandpa's place, my old place. But um, that's a long drive just to get a soldering iron. On the other hand. I could see if she has any of my old Game Boy stuff. I think I have it all. I think she gave it all to me, but I could see. I'm not going to be able to do it today, but. Soldering on stream. That'd be a whole new stage, wouldn't it? <laughs> that would be a whole new who'd have thought soldering on stream in 2021 we could do it I'm, I'm wrapping my head around it right now i'm like how would i do it how would i go about it we're gonna give this one final test uh for the day here in a second once i get it cleaned up and then if that doesn't work uh that means that it this is a soldering iron problem at least to fix this specific issue don't get smoke in the camera. Better than Tarkov streams, Cap. I like Tarkov streams. Don't worry, don't worry. You, you guys can't hurt my feelings on Tarkov streams anymore because I don't do them anymore. So you can't hurt them. Can't hurt my feelings. I think it might be time to visit mom, Gary. My mom's not going to be mad if I visit her. Like, she's going to be happy. She's going to be stoked. Let's be honest. Well, so are you going through the uh, are you going through the OG Tarkov season or the second Tarkov season on YouTube? Like, what's the uh, what color is the thumbnail? The first, cool, cool. Um, IDK, why everyone hates them? Well, it wasn't everyone, <clears throat> to be clear. So also, here's the problem: Tub is clarifying something, and Tub is exactly right in his clarification. Here's the here's the thing that happened. For a long time, I streamed Tarkov with no no skills for streaming Tarkov and also uh, no real ability to entertain the people who were hanging out with me. <laughs> and so what Tub had to sit through was very different than what people had to sit through a lot later. Much later in life, Tarkov streams were just... Uh, enjoyable streams where we chatted about lots of stuff 
they weren't that way originally. They weren't that way always. And Tub was the, uh, was the puppet, uh, not the puppet, was the guinea pig for a lot of those early streams. Uh, early talk of streams were not too entertaining. I mean, you've, you've seen the game. It's so fucking confusing, right? My first 100 to 300 hours into the game, I had no idea what I was doing. And so I couldn't really talk to chat because all I was doing was figuring out where the fuck I was. Then learn some stuff. Exactly, exactly. Very hard game to learn and also stream. All right, chat. Two things we're going to do. Here's the deal, chat. Two things we're going to do. We're going to test with the multimeter to see if I can get power off of this battery contact. Um, when that does not work, because I don't think that it will work, we are also going to plug it in and just hope and pray that some batteries help it work. Um, I don't think that's going to work either. And then, after no neither of those works, I'm going to text my mom and see if I can borrow my grandpa's soldering iron. And we're going to come back and we're going to motherfucking solder this shit. And we're going to have a working Game Boy that has our very own electricity uh, 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 electrical, electrical hands on it. Here's, here's what's the problem is. Let me see if I can get this the right place. Here's what the problem is. Battery contact right here with a spring. At the base of that battery contact, where it touches the board, there is no copper. You see that place where there's a lack of orange directly around it? There is no copper. There needs to be copper there. That copper needs to run to the other orange area. It does not currently, because the corrosion wiped it all away. I'm going to bring out the voltimeter. I'm going to double check what I think to be true, which is that there's no connection between the terminal and the spot. And, uh, and then we have to figure out a way to, to wire, we have to figure out a way to solder some power between those two spots. Wouldn't it be awesome if it just turned on? I know that this part is good. I can't really zoom this in. Let me try it. This is going to be so dumb. You guys are going to get a really up close view right now. <laughs> Don't look too closely. Up, up close view right now. All right. This is hilarious. Uh, okay. So between here and here is the actual circuit board itself. It has power. Between here, the end of the battery terminal, and the base of the battery terminal, we have power. Between the base of the battery terminal and a half a centimeter, a quarter of a centimeter, a third of a centimeter away, we have no power. Which means... That this thing is not going to turn on when I turn it on. The solder actually connects, but it just doesn't connect to the circuit board. <laughs> so, let's test it. And then we'll be done for the day one way or the other. Um, maybe I should have had it this zoomed in the whole time. You guys can actually see, uh, see stuff. Love the toothbrush. Take a look at my toothbrush. She's the only one I got. Ah, da, da, da. La, da, da, da. And then we'll play some Pokemon. How's that sound to you guys? Uh, I still can't tell the difference between scavs and uh, PMCs in uh, in Tarkov. That's okay. Even the pros can only check, can only keep track of that sometimes. All right. Batteries in. If this lights up. All right, batteries are in. If this lights up, it's a miracle. Nope. 
Nothing. So. It looks like. We have to try a soldering iron. Oh, buddy. If, if I try that and it doesn't work, I have no idea what I'm going to do. But here we are. That's where, we're, that's where we've made it. Oh, buddy. All right. Good shit. Exclamation mail. Ooh. What you exclamation mail in for over there, Dante? Bye, Tabtishi. Bye, Tabtishi. All right, let's get things back to normal. I believe in you. Thank you, Strawberry. Either way, we're going to have given it our best go, you know? And at the end of the day, that's all you can do. Give it the best go. Go from there. Chat, what are you guys up to on this fine Wednesday? Enough about my Game Boy that won't work. More about you guys. My shirt isn't in yet either. We got to get your shirt in. Walrus tub. get in some league and chill listen and lurk my tts2 i love it i love it um good luck on the league games walrus tubs own t-shirt isn't in it's a war crime it's a war crime all right so since walrus made me chug an entire water uh earlier i don't have a water and uh, I need to pee. So I'm going to be back in about two seconds, okay? I'm going to do a quick BRB. Gary's doing job applications. Good luck. BRB.